What is up guys? So today we're gonna look some through some battles TV replays uh, in boss arenas Dreadbloom cave And I think in every single one I went with the wizard chipper and farm and up here You can see I've played bolt tricks and seven times harder and people pretty good people and Zao and etc That was just from some tournaments. I was doing uh, in uh, I think he's called the crows discord server and they were pretty fun to be honest um, I actually won one of the tournaments, and in one of them, I died to a single BFB. So, right, let's find this replay. So, the first one, they were going... Actually, no, let's, this one first. So, it was against Johnny Feelgood. So, I'm pretty sure he has a YouTube channel or something, because I recognize his name. Uh, and he gives me the heart eyes. I'm pretty sure I recognize him. So, I was interested in the strat. He was using, like, Sniper. He didn't show it until round 12. Um, sorry, round 10. Uh, for the leads, of course, because, you know, Flash Bomb is extremely overpriced. I mean, it does stun balloons, but it also makes them regrow a lot. Um, so, yeah, he only showed the Sniper on round 10. And I was pretty pretty surprised by the use of Sniper. I mean, I would have thought he would have go gone with, like, Mortar, because Mortar is better, in my opinion. Uh, but then again, what do I know? I'm just, a, I'm just, a, I'm the Moa Pit noob. And Boltrix is the CC god, so... You can see, I'm just going to slow it down briefly. I do, um, with this strat, I get my farm up. Then I start sending reds. And then on round four, I send a few blues. And then boosted pinks over the top of that. And I'm getting a bit of eco. I normally get 300 eco. You can see I hit here, I, lit I have 301 eco. Basically 300. And then I start getting up my farms. Because it, it, you can see it's pressured him a lot. He's down to 80 lives already. I think he could have he could have reduced that by a bit. But again, he, he, he doesn't have mortar. He has sniper. So we couldn't reduce it by that much. And if they send you pink, so I get up a 1-1 one, one wizard. As someone told me in the comment section, that's better than getting a 1-0. But so I get a 1-1. One, uh, a one, one, and then a chipper for the fast balloons, like pinks and blacks, etc. And if they don't send, if they send a, a, a lot of blacks, you get up the lightning bolt. Uh, as you can see, I got the lightning bolt up here. It deals with them absolutely fine. But if they send just a few blacks... Then, to be honest, it's just fine staying with the 1-1. One, one. It's pretty good how it is already. So, you can see that he's slightly above in farms. Um, and I try this a big rush. And he actually has to sell his farms. He boosts. And he gets up a Bloon Jitsu, which is pretty surprising. And you can see he sends a yellow rush at me. And I deal with it fine. I'm sorry I facepalmed, guys. I'm sorry, Johnny. I facepalmed. I was not in a good mood because I faced this Cobra player. It was absolute trash. I was so... I I normally don't rage, but I seriously raged against this uh, because it was such crap. Like, oh my god. Um, he I got him down to four lives. All out at him. A Cobra player. Four lives left. And I died. Because this strat cannot deal with um, Cobra at all. Balloon adjustment is just... Ugh, you can't defend it. So you can see he goes... For, he tries to pressure me, uh, get a boost out of me with some whites, regrows, zebras, etc. Barely does any damage. I just get up another lightning bolt wizard. That's fine. And you can see I am a lot above in farms now. You can see he's got his sniper down at the bottom. Uh, and he sends a, he sends a few regen zebras, uh, etc. Um, but overall, I think I played this game pretty well. So normally, uh, like, I shouldn't say stuff like that. Because everyone's just going to be like, oh my god, you're saying you played well. You, you played absolutely terribly. But to my standards, that is, I played this pretty well. I didn't boost... When I didn't have to. I got up just the right defense for just the right rush. You can see here I didn't have to boost that. It's pretty strong early game, this strat. Really strong early game. And I send grouped leads. And so he has to sell a farm. Uh, and he has to boost as well. I'm not sure if he had to there. But he gets up the assault rifle. It's now around 17. And he gets up his second plantation. Um, and what I do here is I all out because... The assault rifle, I, I've just paused it for a moment so I can talk. The assault rifle will um, will pop the, uh, the balloons into, because he did he hasn't got a .50, which would demolish them. He's just got the full metal jacket for the leads. So you can see they're all turning into yellows, which are going to overwhelm his ninja completely. And I'm going all out here. This is a ginormous regen rainbow rush, which is going to completely go through his defense. He's, he's got no defense against it because that, that that's just enormous. You wouldn't be able to defend that with... I mean, if you got point five five zero, then yes, he would have. Um, right, so let's go through another replay. I'm just going to find a... Maybe I'll go through my Cobra one, perhaps. Uh, but we'll see what other ones you got. You can see I was pretty busy in boss arenas, to be honest. Um, right, let's 
find a decent game. I'm trying to find a decent game that uh, that was actually pretty good. Um, I think I'm going to jump into my Cobra game next. I'll try and um, get rid of the timer, guys, so you don't have to endure, like, you, so you don't know how long the games were, because that's pretty annoying. Um, so you can see, I am so annoyed right here. He's going, I do BM this game. I don't normally BM. Against Cobra, I do BM. Um, <laughs> it's because my this strat cannot defend. To my knowledge, very well with it. I can't deal with balloon adjustment. It's it's just so bad against balloon adjustment because the tornado regrows them, and the um, the fire mage is just not that good against it. It just isn't that good. Um, and the cobra strat is just really good in every way apart from late game. But you can't survive <laughs> until late game with this. Um, oh, also, I'm pretty sure I've sorted out the audio, guys. Uh, which is good because the audio is messing up, but it seems to be okay now. Um, I'm sending him the angry emoji because I'm just so annoyed he is going Cobra. It is absolutely ridiculous. Like, Cobra Cobra in 2017. Well, not 2017, but um, Cobra, like, it got nerfed, but it didn't get nerfed en enough, in my opinion. Uh, it, it was only, it wasn't even the balloon adjustment or wide funds that got nerfed. I mean, the mortar got nerfed a little bit, but it's neg negligible with the strat, really. So the Cobra strat is still pretty good. There are strats that are better uh, than it. So if I went Ninja Mortar right here, I'd demolish him. Because all you need is a, a signal flare or eventually an artillery battery once there are tons of camos. Because um, uh, w w when there are tons of camos, you, you need the artillery battery up. The signal flare cannot deal with it at all. And then you get a big one up. And maybe a Bloom Jitsu at the back just to, you know, make sure you don't leak. And that can defend it fine. And then you just outlast them. And then you, like, send a few Zoma Gods. And they can't defend it. But it's interesting that he actually went Ninja in this one rather than Bomb. And he seemed to do a very, very good job. In hindsight, I should have gone All Out Rush. I should have done an All Out Rush straight away. Uh, but sadly, that is not what happened. That is not what happened, guys. Um... I'm trying to think of a good other replay I can show you. I'm sorry it's Battles TV, guys. Um, it's just I couldn't do a live commentary while doing these games. Uh, you can see he starts balloon adjusting me and I thumbs down him. Um, you can see that there were, for some reason, some camo whites there. I don't even know why. But the balloon adjustment is starting to get problematic. Um, I send some a beefy regen rainbow rush and you can see ceramics already coming on my side, which is bad. Um, don't know why I spiked it. I probably should have used my chipper to my advantage. You can see he almost dies there. He has to boost that. So I'm thinking, right, so he's boosted. All I can really do is, uh, as I've um, got his boost, baited his boost, I can go all out with some regen rainbows. And I do indeed go all out with regen rainbows. Now, I rage so hard in this one. Uh, I'm sorry I didn't do a live commentary so you could you, you could see it. But look, so he gets, obviously, he gets his big one up. Um, and look, it's it's uh, it's so bad. He, he leaks down to four lives. What I should have done was boost um, camo pinks and try and get some past. But by this point, you can see by my thumbs downing, I was just so mad. And then for the first time, he starts chatting, saying hi, and then the thumbs up. Triggered me so much. I was so angry. But, you know, it's not his fault. He's, if he wants to go Cobra, he can go Cobra. Whatever. I'm not going to judge him for it. At the end, I did say good game, of course. And he said good game back. Whatever happens in the game is left in the game. And after in the lobby, it's fine. It's fine. And it, <laughs> he said he oops. Uh, boost the camo regen reds at me to trigger me even more. Uh, but, uh, but, again, I, I did say good game. I did say good game. Um, hopefully, maybe it will show up if I fast forward. Will it, will it show that I say good game? Yep, we both say good game. Uh, just proof of that. So, and then we thumbs up. So, I wasn't too triggered, uh, but I, I was quite a lot. So, right, let's find another good opponent. I can't, I can't remember. Um, oh, this was a, this was a good one. This was an interesting one. So, this, my opponent. So, I was so happy. He was going uh, with the wizard and the ace. Whereas, I was going with the wizard and the chipper. Of course, far being our other tower as like nothing else can be really um but this was a pretty interesting game in my opinion so both going uh both going wizard i have a slightly different placement i also do the eco thing at the start the mixed eco thing with sending the reds uh, i'm trying to get up to 300 eco putting a bit of pressure on him and for pinks this guy uh, zombie i guess is his name he has to get up 
um, a lightning bolt, and he gets it up straight away to these reds. He gets it up straight away, so there's no point pressuring him. And I just get up, a, I can just get up a chipper for the pinks, which is slightly less money. But then again, for the blacks, I have to get up a lightning bolt, um, so he can be a tiny bit more greedy. I have a, I'm, I'm slightly ahead in farms right now because he, well, I mean, he did go for the plantation, um, so he's one banana head, I guess. Perhaps I should have gone for the plantation. I'm not really sure. But anyway, he has a better defense at the moment than me. You can see he will... I, I sent a few blacks just to force him to get up another wizard. But in fact, I only force a one... No, zero, zero, in fact. Which isn't really worth it. Uh, he sent some blacks at me. And I'm actually pretty greedy. And in the end, um, he stops... Uh, sorry, I wasn't greedy. I, I just... I just... Wait, what? I Okay. Forget what I just said. I, apparently, I do get up the lightning bolt, so whatever. And I send some regen whites at him. And this does a lot of damage. So he has to get up another lightning bolt, which means I can get further ahead in farms. Um, but in fact, I'm not really ahead in farms at all. However, I have a bit more eco. And he has a better defense, actually, which is surprising. So to be honest, I'm really... Well, he's actually a kind of up at the moment compared to me. And he's just got that eco back, so... To be honest, he is ahead. Uh, he is ahead of me at the moment, uh, which is kind of depressing. <laughs> to be honest, kind of depressing, guys. Uh, that he is ahead of me, but I think. I mean, he is better late game as well. But I'd say late, uh, mid game. I'm actually. To be honest, to be honest, he is better late game and mid game. I, I would say I'm a tiny bit better early game. Um, and you can see. That I have, he has a lot of money saved up right now. To get that Operation Dart Stomp, if I send some stuff. I send a Camo Ceramic just to force him to get that Fire Mage. And he sends a Camo Ceramic at me. Which again, I get a, I get a Mage up to deal with that. Because it's pretty good against that. And we both go for our BIA at exactly the same time. I have a tiny bit more money. He has a tiny bit more eco. And I have a better defense than him right now. Um, in fact, he actually has a plantation, and I don't, so he's he's up in money, I'm up in defense, he's up in eco. Um, so we're pretty close at the moment. Um, what I should have done, I think, was send a Moab, because it would have forced him to perhaps sell his plantation, or at least sell his lightning wizard. And I go for a large ceramic rush, which did absolutely nothing, and yeah, that was a pretty poor rush, to be honest. I don't know why I went for that, it was a pretty bad rush. I thought it would do more than it actually did. Oh well, guys. Oh well. And so, round 20. The the thing I should do is send a BFB. And you can see I send a BFB because uh, he doesn't have Chipper to suck in the ceramics. And he has to deal with this with the Phoenix and the Tornado Mage. And you have to have you have to be pretty good at this strat to deal with it. You can see he gets up two Phoenixes to deal with this. And well, he dies. He dies. I don't know how. I thought he would have been able to defend that. He should have got up a, torn a Tornado Mage at the bottom. Right, so let's go into one more game. Um, hmm. Hmm. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll actually... I know. What about going through a game with Boltrix? Yes, why not a game with Boltrix? Because, you know, it's there. Why don't I just go through it? So, I think we'll go into... This one in, on cards. It was a what the hell? Oh, no, it is. It's just loading. Okay, so I'm gonna fast forward this I think this is gonna be the last replay. I look through in the video I'm sorry if you don't like the replay videos battles TV replay videos. I'm sorry about that Some, Sometimes I just can't do anything about it um, So sometimes I will upload battles TV gameplay. So you're gonna have to get used to it other other youtubers do it as well Like Jaja Josh. I know commentary youtubers don't do it, but I kind of like doing uh, videos I like knowing that I can do a good game and then commentate it on Battles TV. I kind of like that. So again, I'm going Wizard Farm Chipper. He's going Dark Farm Ace. We decided not to use Fourth Towers at all. Um, we thought that was fair. He sends me a few pinks, but he doesn't send me much. Um, but then he sends me some more, so I do get up the Chipper. Uh, and I'm just continuously sending him pinks. Because the dark spots on this map aren't the greatest. To be honest, this map is one of my least favorite maps. It's really, I, do, I don't like it. I don't know what, uh, what like, strats go well on it. I mean, going wizard chipper farm is actually quite, or wiz farm chipper, whatever you want to, whichever way round you want to call it, um, is actually pretty decent on this map, as I found out, because it's a medium length map. It's not short. Um, 
it's kind of, yeah, it's a medium, it's a medium length map. I'm not sure which one is longer, offside or this one. I'm assuming offside is slightly longer, but I could be wrong there. Um, so anyway, Spiker Pot on this map is so bad, and he gets it up late as well. So he's going to have to energy to the yellows, which I stop sending straight away. So I get, I get him to drain himself by getting the Spiker Pot. Plus, I get a boost out of him, which is pretty nice. And which means that I can get up. No, he's actually up in farms. But I have a better defense in my opinion. And I have basically 100 more eco. Which does actually mean something. Um, so I force him to get up his jug. Then I send some camo regen zebras guys. Camo regen zebras. Um, to, and then some whites to, to base and energy. And you know he's going to have to energy this. Like there's no way he's not energying that. And in fact he doesn't energy. So he actually defends that without the energy. Which... I was really surprised by it. Um, actually, during this, I was on voice chat to Boltrix and some other people like Lemo um, and other people. And we were commentating this. Well, not commentating. We were talking about the games. It was, it was pretty fun, to be honest. So, I go for some regen zebras and some yellows. We bait the energy off him. Um, and then, you know, because we baited the energy, we can go for a decent-sized re-rush, which is exactly what we do. Decent-sized regen zebra rush. And because the spiker pot positions on this map are pretty poor, um, this small at Region Zebra Rush, because he doesn't have any energy, it kills him. And Boltrix goes down. I actually need to follow Boltrix. Oh, no, I'm already followed. I just unfollowed. Rip. Um, so, yeah, that's going to be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed. Uh, let's just look who's on the popular ones. <laughs> Gaming Malt. That may not be the real one. Probably is. YouTube Lemo. <laughs> Gaming Malt for Master of... Marwin Crochet, Gaming Malt, Marwin Crochet v, um, Voltrix actually there, right, okay, David the Superior, uh, <laughs> Daniel Geese, all, all recognisable names, so yeah, um, on, I actually, there's an update for, um, BTD Battles with, like, some cool skins and stuff, uh, which I have not got, uh, which is pretty sad, I haven't got it, so, or do I, no, I do not have it, so hopefully, I will get that soon, guys. So I'm going to end the video here. I really hope you enjoyed and see you in the next one.